Welcome back to another Geek Up video. Today I'm going to be discussing the question that is a very up and coming at the moment: is should you wait for Skylake? And if you don't know what Skylake is, it's Intel's. It's going to be Intel's new consumer platform for DDR for like X99, which is the enthusiast stuff that uses the DDR4. That's when DDR4 is going to come uh, to the consumer level. And shall we say rather than the enthusiast level and now is a really difficult time to be building a PC especially if it's going to be one that's that revolves around editing gaming isn't so much of an issue because DDR3 really isn't too bad at all for gaming but when there's a new thing coming out you don't really want to build your PC and then two months later be outdated because a whole new architecture has come out and DDR4 is a big thing DDR4 DDR3 has been out for years now and DDR4 most certainly will be out for years as well so should you wait for Skylake or should you wait specifically for consumer DDR4? And now there are speculations that it will come December time, January time, end of summer, uh, autumn, sort of full time. Um, but it is sort of rumoured to be around the January time and that's pretty much what's being sort of confirmed, shall we say, at the moment. And many of the, many of the, um, the new Intel motherboards um, do look very, do have a lot of extra features um, on the Skylake platform which are slowly emerging and you can't, you will not, you will not be able to use a current um, Intel consumer motherboard, so the LGA 1150 socket, that will not be compatible with Skylake series of CPUs. So it takes me back to the original question, should you wait for Skylake? Now it's is if you you could argue this about every single component, you could wait another month for that one graphics card or another month for that one power supply to come out or another month for that one case to come out and there is gonna be a time where you're gonna to have to draw the line. But when there's a whole new consumer platform coming out, if if you editing is your thing and you don't really want to be outdated before you start, then wait for Skylake or at least wait for consumer DDR4. If you have found this video insightful or helpful in any way, remember to like, comment, rate, and please do subscribe, and we'll see you in the next Geek What video.